Hello there, Golfer here, and welcome back to some more of my Let's Play Dragon Age Inquisition. We left stuff off. I don't really remember what we were doing, and I apparently don't have the right hotkey profile set. No, I do not. There we go. So I believe where we were last going to go was here. We're going to travel here. We are going to take Cassandra, which is appropriate. And so, well, let's see. I think Vivian would be theoretically better. Yeah, I think Vivian. I wonder if these areas have enemy are are still like uh, level capped, because they said that most of the enemies. Are based or their difficulties and stuff are based on areas and not based upon uh, where you are, so it's no level scaling. I understand a little bit how there should be a little bit of that though. Like let's say there's a twelve enemies could be like twelve to thirteen or twelve to fourteen or something like that, and it's based upon your levels. So let's say you're level fourteen and above, it's going to be level fourteen. Whereas if you're level thirteen, they'll be level twelve or something like that. So it's a little bit more balanced, and that way you're not just like in this mindlessly slaughtering them. Although to be fair, in that case, you won't be getting any XP, which is fine because enemies respawn. I don't think they respawn in Origins, so XP was relatively limited. And if they did, they it wasn't worth very much. So it was. Um, it's not as important, I guess. And you can theoretically farm until you reach your maximum level because there is no level cap. There's a soft level cap, but that's it. Okay. Care Oswin. Odd that the trail should lead us here. Ban Loren is a pious, unassuming man. What has he become involved in? He might simply be a victim as well. Let's see what lies within. Everybody needs to level. Okay. I'm not really that interested in getting her the uh, specialization. Oh, is my inventory really that full? Oh, it is that full. Ugh. It's probably better for. Oh, I can't leave that way, huh? Well, I definitely should go back. That's especially a special area that I won't be uh, coming back to, and my headset powered off annoyingly. Since I won't be able to come back to this area, um, I definitely want to be able to collect everything here. So we'll just travel to Skyhold real quick. It is annoying to go through these latrines, but I need to sell my junk. Plus, I'm not getting a ton of cash either, even though I'm kind of maximizing that.
may not have been the best place to go to, but they're all going to be relatively busy. Okay, well, we got stores down this way. I don't think I take fall damage, so... So... It's not strong enough. It might be pretty good. As me that. Keep one of those. I'm not sure if these take, uh, yeah, they do take space. I'll just sell the non-good stuff. Oh! <laughs> Bye back. Of course I can't buy any of that. Okay. Now that my inventory is emptier, Hopefully this won't be too long a load. It does appear to have a, a... Oh, wow. Oh, that's why it takes so long to load. I wonder if I can change that. It appears to have an 8 gigabyte max for the RAM. And it was at 8 gigabytes, and then it immediately dropped down to 6 gigabytes, which means it dropped 2 gigabytes of RAM. I have 16 gigabytes in my computers, so that shouldn't be an issue. And yeah, this entire loading is basically just putting information in the RAM, isn't it? I'll have to look into seeing if I can uh, increase the RAM usage. Maybe like 12 to 14 gigs. So theoretically, then, I would be able to keep... Unless it automatically gets rid of it. So I'm back up to about 8 gigabytes again. Just under it. Bark, bark. Probably hear the neighbor dogs. Should be an easy area. One down. Red Templars, huh? Showing up. Promises. I should have known. The Order of Fiery Promise is a cult with strange beliefs about the Seekers. They've hounded us for centuries. What kind of strange beliefs? They believe 
They are seekers, the only rightful ones. They say we robbed their powers long ago, preventing them from ending the world. Ending the world? The only way to truly eradicate evil in their eyes, the world will be reborn a paradise. It's all nonsense. Cultists? Why am I not surprised? This explains why the Seekers might be here, but not the connection to Corypheus. Corypheus could be using him. Ironically enough, though, the term cult, as it's used, is basically a non-mainstream religion or an offshoot of it, but technically all religions are cults. Chanters come out. That's why. That's why looking for this kind of thing or looking for uh, like loot and stuff is good. Oh, that's terrible, terrible. That's half the damage that I want. Oh well, sell it for gold. A seeker. Did they torture him to death? The promises will pay for this. Fate touch stuff, that's good. As the seekers of truth have proven resistant to the effects of Red Lyrium, the Elder One has seen fit to place them in your care. Reclaim your destiny and know that the Elder One expects your devotion as repayment. Signed by Magister Calpurnia. Leader of the Venatori. Does Corypheus not realize the promises want the world to end? What use are they to him? Corypheus will probably betray them before they get their chance. But after he gets what he needs out of them. But this doesn't explain how he captured the Seekers in the first place, or what's been done with them. We must keep looking. The letter said Seekers were resistant to Red Lyrian. Our abilities grant us many gifts, but the resistance to Red Lyrium's corruption? That seems strange. Although it would explain why none have numbered among the Red Templars. And thus, Seekers would be useless to Corypheus. He would have no leash to hold us. We'll find them, Cassandra. I know we will. One way or another.
me all the loot. Lots and lots of junk stuff, but... Oh well. I get the feeling I'm gonna need more gold at some point. Lots of loot and stuff. Daniel! Daniel! Can you hear me? Cassandra! It is you. You're alive. As are you. I'm so glad I found you. No, they put a, a demon inside me. It's tearing me up. What? You can't be possessed. That's impossible. I'm not possessed. They fed me things. I can feel it growing. Can we do anything? I don't know. This thing inside him. The Lord Seeker. You have to find him. Of course we'll find him. If he lives, we'll... Lucius betrayed us, Cassandra. He sent us here, one by one. An important mission, he said. Lies. He was here with them all along. He's still working with them. Could it have been the demon from Therinfal? No. The demon came later. But a demon couldn't simply take his place without anyone noticing. The Lord Seeker allowed it. He let the demon take command while he... ...came here. Yeah, what the heck is going on? Would he really work with these cultists? I intend to find out. Wait! Don't leave me like this, please! You should have come with me. 
You didn't believe in the war any more than I did. You know me. I wanted that promotion. <coughs> Go to the Maker's side, Daniel. You will be welcome. He was my apprentice. I have never known a finer young man. Now we find Lord Seeker Lucius. Not sure if I'm gonna come back here, but I might as well grab this stuff. Really it. Okay, that was just that area. Got it. Do I say like is there like a secret here or something? But no. Lord Seeker Lucius. Cassandra, with a man I can only assume is the new Inquisitor. You must be very proud of your handiwork. I presume you know we Seekers of Truth were once the original Inquisition. Oh yes, we fought to restore order in a time of madness long ago, as you do now. And we became proud. We sought to remake the world. To make it better. But what did we create? The Chantry. The Circles of Magi. A war that will see no end. You lured your entire order to their deaths. There was no other choice. No other choice? Have you gone mad? We Seekers are abominations, Cassandra. We created a decaying world and fought to preserve it even as it crumbled. We had to be stopped. You don't believe me? See for yourself. The secrets of our order passed to me after the former Lord Seeker was slain. 
The war with the mages had already begun, but it was not too late for me to do the right thing. And this was the right thing. Lord Seeker, what you've done. I know. What Corypheus did with the Templars does not matter. I have seen the future. I have created a new order to replace the old. The world will end so we can start anew. A pure beginning. Join us, Cassandra. It is the Maker's will. Wow, he was really weak. He died really pathetically. He was insane. He had to be. Perhaps the Envy Demon's influence? Remove the Lord Seeker so it could take over the Templars. All these wasted lives. He could not have destroyed all of us. I won't accept it. Let us return to Skyhold. I wish to see what's in this book of secrets. That's the way out. Wow, my inventory is almost full again. Well, I guess we can go back and talk to her. You know, it's actually time for me to cut the video off. So thank you all very much for watching, and God bless.